I found out about this artist uh, about probably five days ago or something on Instagram, um, and I decided that I would just add the artist to my reaction list. Uh, his account is mostly kind of a joke about about age, like looking like he's 44 or looking like he's 31 or yeah just it's an odd kind of joke like throughout his Instagram and uh, I was just curious like what his music actually sounds like. Um, What's funny is, he kind of, like, from what I heard of it, it kind of has, like, an, an old, like, alternative sound of, like, you know, the way that things were kind of, like, back around 2007-ish, um, which for me is pretty nostalgic, so... I'm curious to see how his music sounds um, like to listen to something by him all the way through. It's okay, I just want you to stay that was sweet um I loved the I felt like the music the quality of it was um 
the old fashioned and I liked the way that the video kind of um, echoed it with a sort of like home movie kind of look. Um, so that was enjoyable. Um, going to click something else now. no idea what the um, Spanish parts meant. Um, the English parts were funny. <laughs> I, um, I liked both of their voices. I loved the music. I thought that the music had like a nice kind of relaxing alternative sound to it. Okay, I'm already intrigued now. Um, so I have a character named Violet, so in my Disco's book series and animated series, so I'm curious about anything that has anything to do with other um, other characters named Violet and other things. It's always fascinating to me.
symbolism of it was really interesting with the um, like she was the one who it seemed like was um, going through something but showing how it was affecting him that he was falling apart too uh, by showing the the thing of him crashing um, I 
I couldn't tell what all of the lyrics were, uh, but I thought it was... The music itself was really relaxing, but the... The video was, um... Beautiful, but heartbreaking, um... I'll go to the next one.